the Dark Continent is going to be one of the hypest arcs of 2021's Hunter x Hunter Returns and the trailer for it definitely will not disappoint because we know that a lot of spooky things are going to get revealed to us and with the return of Hunter x Hunter coming back in 2020 most likely we do know that we could be getting an anime and a manga release because the anime would return with a Dark Continent Expedition trailer. Yes, we know the anime obviously did leave all at a good point because it looked like an ending but if you guys read the manga like myself you would know that it's nowhere near close to being ending but we do know that the manga it would return in the dark continent expedition arc because we do know the anime it would still have to build up to it it would have to recruit all the members show that stuff whereas the manga we are near the ending of the arc and i don't really know why togashi chose to leave right there because he could have literally just finished it off but no in all seriousness we do do know that the manga let's be honest here chief it would definitely most likely return before the anime because the anime it does not look like we would get a hunter x hunter 2011 maybe a hunter x hunter 2020 continuation the hardest thing about the anime to be honest would just be figuring out the title for it because they already made so many different series they have more hunter x hunter series than i have channels but though in all seriousness we do know or at least if you're a manga reader you would know that the manga isn't bad because the hypest moments do not disappoint regardless of the art uh contrary to popular belief because we see the phantom troop the princes netro all the hype characters they're still there and to be honest the manga i actually do think that it is a good way to actually experience hunter x hunter not saying it's better than the anime no 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 don't don't say that don't think that phantom man thinks that the hunter x hunter manga is better than the anime but i am saying that the hype moments definitely do impact when togashi actually does try which is why i do think when he does come back he will enter the dark continent yes that's why i believe togashi is taking his time because with us being close to the end of the dark continent expedition once we do come back we will be in the dark continent and we do know that that's where we're going to get revealed to things like dawn freaks yes we know gene gone all that we already know i sound like a broken record when it comes to dawn freaks but he is going to be revealed to us and we know that alongside with him the west side of the dark content is going to get revealed and to be honest that could be an arc in of itself because we know that dawn freaks he has the east side already figured out but we still have to explore the west side so we don't know if that's just going to be a whole arc exploring that because we still have to handle the chimera ants origin so let's just say for example what if the chimera ants came from the east side that would explain where they come from but then that would still mean the west side is still spooky or vice versa it would just mean that the chimera and still have a lot more that we have to learn about and speaking of characters we gotta learn about the zodic family just when we thought that we knew everything no we know that zig zodic actually did travel with netro to the dark continent and we do know about maha zodic so i definitely do think that maha and zig zodic they definitely Definitely are hints at a new Zodic member being on the Dark Continent, and maybe we'll get uh, uh, like I, I guess you could say a relationship similar to Gon and Killua, but with Dawn and whoever else will be on the uh, Dark Continent for the Zodic family. Because I doubt it will be Maha or, or Zig Zodic still, so it would have to be a whole new member. And speaking of the Zodic families, a Luca's true family, aka the Calamities, will be revealed and new Calamities potentially because a Luca wasn't really considered a calamity but yet she's still that dangerous so i'm interested to see if there are going to be some new calamities that get revealed in the new dark continent trailer comment what you guys think down below subscribe if you haven't peace out